about this tradition down there. You're one of the guys that started it. Mount Carmel, you were the head coach there. You were playing Berwick in the schedule. You took him off and you went with the Tigers. Right, and then how did that develop with your idea in your head? Well, to be honest with you, I didn't want to play either one. Of them. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, between, I didn't want to play you either, though. Between Berwick and Southern. But at the time when, when the state championships and the points were all, you know, things were coming together, uh, the team you beat with the most wins where you're going to get the most points. Now, as I said, Berwick was going to get a lot of wins, and so was Southern. But Southern being the proximity, uh, close to us, uh, it was just written all over, let's play. And the fact that we were playing a AAA Berwick and we were a AA school, you know, leave the large schools play. That, a lot of large school, small school talk, and I thought that was a good transition for us. And uh, it certainly helped us, because Berwick then, we weren't beating Berwick. Berwick ended up winning the state title. And I think it was twice, all three of us, within a triangle, hit state championships the same year. Right. And it was amazing, the community spirit between each of the districts. Right. I mean, getting mail from Berwick, getting mail from Southern, good mail, and uh, vice versa. Well, know. we talked about that a couple of years ago in Coach's Corner. That was the heyday when you had Mount Carmel, Berwick, and Southern all yes. at the top. And, and Mount Carmel kept winning state titles, what, even, even years? Yep, 94, and, 96, 98. Mm -hmm. and, and then right after that, when Southern Columbia kept losing state titles, it was after that when Mount Carmel didn't kind of faltered a little bit, not, not a, at, again, at a smaller level, Southern took off and won those five state titles in I a think, row. I think it really helped Southern uh, along the way, you know, just because Absolute of the competition. Mount Carmel. Exactly. And, and Berwick had their rivalries up north here, you know, when I say up north in right. Scranton, Wilkes-Barre area. So Jimmy Roth owes you half those wins. Well, Jimmy Roth, you know, <laughs> he's a pretty good coach. All right. Well, again, it'll be another barn burner at Southern Columbia, Mount Carmel going at it on Friday night.